Hi, I'm Incredible Jane. I'm here at the Runner's Den in Port Moody with Paul getting my official shoe fitting. So let's get you started. At this point in time, we're not sure what we're on, embarking on in terms of uh, activity, but we're going to plan for obviously the run portion of the triathlon or a half marathon. So this will be great. Okay. Let's get you standing up. Perfect. And your feet about six inches apart. And just have you bend forward at the knees for me. Bend, bend, okay. bend. Great. So what we're doing is taking a look and seeing what the arches are doing, just through a little bit of a weight bearing process. What we'll do is we'll actually, since we have the camera, we'll have you walk away from the camera okay. and just as naturally as you can, just walk towards the far wall. So we'll get you to do okay. that. We'll just take a look at your foot movement and just have you come on back to Great. So basically what we're doing is we're taking a look at um, what the arches are doing, if our feet are moving inwards, outwards. So basically what we want is we want a shoe to fit fairly snugly through the sort of the back two thirds of the shoe with some space up at the, the forefoot. So wide across the width area so that there's nothing pinching, no, no pressure points. And then uh, we've got some wiggle room for the toes. As we go longer distances, our feet tend to swell a little bit. So we want to have that, uh, have that space for sure. How does that feel just uh, very comfortable off the bat? Very comfortable. So what we want to do is get you to, let's get you walking. Uh, we'll get you towards the front door and then um, we're going to send you outside. I'm going to come outside with you and take a look at you moving in the shoes as well. So now what we're going to do is have you run away, right away from us in the camera and then have you come back towards us so we get an opportunity to see you through movement. Okay. So just having a look at you through movement, the shoes seem to be doing what they should be doing. How are they feeling on your feet? They feel great. A good running shoe nowadays, no, su no such thing as a wear in period. It should just feel good right off the get go. Everything um, should be feeling like it belongs in the right spots. There's no pressure points, nothing digging or pressing into it. Okay, so round two, same process. Have you run down and back and then we'll get another opportunity to take a look at things and just uh, focus on feeling how the shoe feels on your foot and we'll take a look mechanically and see what's going on. It feels good, you can definitely tell the difference between the first and the second pair. Okay. These feel a little firmer and a little more like they cup the heel a little bit more. Okay, so yeah. feeling a little bit more stable would you say? Or I'd say so, yeah. It's always a bonus if the, uh, the colors match our clothing outfits, but uh, <laughs> the big thing there is our feet don't know color and we really need to let our feet decide what, what feels best on. And how long should a shoe last? Good question. Um, in terms of durability with a shoe, it really depends uh, on a lot of factors. Um, how much you're doing in terms of running, how often you're running, mm -hmm. uh, where you're running. Um, as a runner, sort of your body weight, uh, where you tend to land mm -hmm. on your shoes. Um, sort of a multi-pronged question, but uh, the general uh, consensus from suppliers is uh, anywhere from about 300 to 500 miles. All right, let's try out third choice from Paul. Wow, you can really feel the difference. Yeah. yeah. So? I have to say, I think the first choice was the best choice. First pair so far. Mm -hmm. So we go back and put those ones back on your feet and see how they feel. I got to tell you, Paul, these shoes make me want to run. That's fantastic. <laughs> and that's, that's certainly what, uh, you know, you, you can't, you can read all the magazines and read all the books about, you know, uh, what it is that you're looking for in your shoes. But if you can find a shoe that uh, makes you want to run, yeah. you can't go, can't go wrong there. Mechanically, everything looks good. And you know, you're, you're getting that feedback from your feet and your body telling you that this the shoe feels good and that's uh, that's what we're after but let's take one more look and just make sure that we're we're nailing it in terms of mechanically everything's mm -hmm. in alignment and everything else is uh, certainly the feedback you're giving this might be the pair perfect they feel great they look good too yep. so in terms of mechanically color that's uh, up to you uh, whether they work for you or not but we know they're gonna work for your feet and that's uh, most important that's the best advice that I've gotten and you've really helped help me find the perfect fit shoe here at the runner stand in Port Moody Thanks, well, Paul. Good luck with all your training. Thank you very much. Thanks for stopping by. Okay, bye-bye.